Okay, part two of the tour, coming upstairs. When you come up here, you have all this nice living space. So that's my bedroom, some cat toys here. That's my closet. That's the cat feeding station. That's my office. I'll show you each of those, but first, when you come up to the top of the stairs, you have this nice area here that's kind of like having an attic, a storage room. So I have these shelves that I had made previously at my previous house, so I brought them over, set them up here. Uh, there's still space in here for me to like organize some things, uh, but Christmas decorations and such are here. These are some boxes that I need to sort through. Uh, kitty litter stations here. Um, all the kitty litter boxes are upstairs. And this is my office. <clears throat> I have a bunk bed here. Uh, so eventually people I have a beautiful balcony. In fact, This is a mango tree, so you can pick mangoes right here from it. There's the drain that actually has some leaves on it right now, so if it's gonna rain, I'll need to clean them up because that, rain, that plug clogged and caused water to flood in here. Whoops. <clears throat> and there's kitty kitty. Let's get kitty kitty in the house. Okay. This is just a bookcase here. So I just keep it covered with that. Another bookcase, filing cabinet, desk area. So definitely some sorting and then definitely sorting here. This is the mess. Uh, if you didn't know, I had everything shipped, four pallets shipped to here to Cambodia from California. Uh, there is a, a full bathroom in here. Ah, this I moved these here after that flood. Uh, but yeah, full bathroom. Again, a kitty litter box upstairs. So no smell because I have an Airbnb room downstairs. Um, here's this room I use for my closet. So I have all these racks of clothes. I have a wardrobe. There's another full bathroom right there. There's another small balcony right there. Um, so there's definitely some sorting that needs to happen in here. Then this is my room. We have water and some food bowls, my little chair, my vanity, my little refrigerator, air con, a <laughs> I have us turn this way so that when I'm in the bed, I can like reach whatever's there. Um, that needs to be sorted, but a little shelf. And then this little shelf, which is like a dresser. So it's got my undies and stuff in it. I've got some stuff here. I used to have a kettle here, but I, it's downstairs right now. These are the clothes that I'll like wear again. And my beautiful bathroom, another kitty litter box my shower and stuff okay the other amazing thing is out here is a great patio that I want to turn into a catio so let me close the door so the cats don't follow me out a lot of people love all the the work on the ceilings. This is like normal in Cambodia. It's nothing special here. Uh, so yeah, I want to turn all of the, you know, enclose this in with fencing and then I can have it as a catio, put a, put a little door here to the lower part or eventually, you know, enclose this part in as well. There is water so that if I have plants, I can water the plants. Um, no flooding here happening yet. Oh, there's a nice big drain right there. Uh, these are all mango trees as well. I had a Cambodian tell me that there's um, 
one of these three is like this special kind of mango that everybody loves. And there's not really any blooming right now, but if you can see, there's, there's jasmine, like a pink jasmine right in here. That's like a vine that's crawling up in these trees. So, oh, there's, there you can see some right there of the pink jasmine. So that's it, that's upstairs. Now you know, and uh, okay. Thanks for joining me.